What's going on guys? Today we are going to be doing a little field test and review of the original Kickstart by Rector Seal. Rector Seal was kind enough to send me a couple products to do some reviews on, so up first is going to be the original Kickstart. This particular model is a 1 to 3 ton, which is going to be perfect for my application, which is going to be at my house, my little 2.5 ton Bryant heat pump. We're going to hook this up on there, and basically what we're going to do is it currently has a I believe it's a SUPCO um, starting device on it right now. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take that off. We're going to start the system with no start assist. We're going to start the system with the current start assist that I have on there. And then we're going to install this bad boy and see which one's better. Um, see what kind, of, what kind of results we have. So very, very simple to install. Everything comes factory wired other than two two wire connections, just two blue wires. One goes to the C terminal on the capacitor, which is run, and the other one goes to the Herm terminal, and you are good to go. There is the instructions. Very, very simple. Obviously, it's for single phase use. Uh, Recip compressors, scroll compressors, rotary compressors, AC refrigeration, heat pumps, pretty much one-stop shop for this starting device. They come in two different sizes. Try to zoom in for you so you can get the part numbers if you need them. One to three ton and three and a half to five. Again, we're using the one to three ton on my unit. But yeah, we're gonna go ahead and hook it up, do a couple tests and see what the results are. So stay tuned and let's find out how well the kickstart works. All right, this is gonna be our, basically our baseline test no start device and we're gonna turn our 770-3 on we are going to set it to inrush and I'm gonna put the disconnect in and we'll see what we got Seven. 77.0 so now that we got our baseline I'm gonna go ahead and shut this down I'm gonna hook up the small super boost this little guy right here made by Supco and we'll see what we got after that. As you can see, we have our Subco starting device in there wired up. Trying to get this camera positioned again. We've got our Testo 770-3 set on inrush. And it's been, I don't know, about five minutes or so. So we'll go ahead and start her up and see what she draws this time. Very, very little difference. 82.5. So I'll go ahead and shut her down. And now we are going to install our kickstart by Rector Seal. And this one is good for, not sure if the camera will focus, one to three tons. This unit being a two and a half ton should be perfect. So. We'll go ahead and get her installed and see what she does with the kickstart. All right, we got our kickstart mounted, ready to go. Comes with uh, basically all your mounting hardware aside from two screws. Very easy to install, very quick. Just a little two wire, uh, two wire setup. Everything else is already factory wired. So we are ready to go. Got our Testo 770-3 set on inrush again. And we will fire this girl up and see what she does this time. Oh man, much, much better. She 
sounded happier. 46.5. So we cut those starting amps in half. So in the low to mid 80s by itself and with the, uh, the little subco. Down to 46.5 with the kickstart. So obviously our best bet is to leave this little kickstart in there. Well, I'd say this review is a success. The product worked very well um, compared to the other one. Dropped our starting amps from, I believe we were at about 89 with no start assist. With the Supco, it dropped it to 82, almost no change at all. And then we went to the kickstart, which dropped it down to, I believe it was around 46 amps. So usually with the locked rotor um, this compressor being 77 i typically like to see the amp draw no more than 50 percent but as you can see um, this one was drawing well over its rated lock rotor amps so i mean it's it's a great product but it doesn't work miracles um, but i'd highly highly recommend it um, i left the other one on my unit and that's where it will stay but um yeah i I can't recommend it enough out of the starting devices that uh, that I've tested. I like this one. I like this one. Um, I like the separate, the independent relay from capacitor. Um, been very fond of that for, for many, many years. Um, but I like this because it's all in one package. There's two different sizes. It's very simple. Um, and it works, which is the most important part. So again, I want to thank Rector Seal for sending me these products to review. Greatly appreciated. And um, yeah, I hope this helps anybody that was interested in the product. Again, I'll give you those model numbers for the two different sizes. I want to thank everybody for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, and we will see you on the next one.